Hi everybody, um, this is like an addendum to my last video uh, about Occupy Wall Street. Uh, I mentioned briefly about a giant tsunami that could quite possibly hit uh, the east coast um, along, uh, well all along the uh, east coast uh, in particular uh, n New York City. Uh, the way uh, how this tsunami will um, hit directly towards uh, New York City. Um, I have a lot of some links that I need to share and uh, I also like to direct you to uh, Henning Kimmler's who is uh, 2010 The Countdown. He has a video um, showing that how this um, particular uh, tsunami will come about. Um, I just want to give a little bit of information about the timeline of some uh, recent um, major earthquakes that has happened since 2001. Uh, in January uh, 2001, uh, India was struck with a 7.7 uh, earthquake that killed um, close to 20,000 people. Um, and then, uh, well, just recently also, uh, there was a uh, well no actually that was September the 15th that a 7.3 magnitude quake uh, struck the Fiji Islands okay um, and that uh, the Turkey uh, earthquake yeah you know, the Turkey earthquake that uh, you know really rocked uh, uh, most of Turkey um, yeah, a lot, a lot of people. At least this happened in East Turkey. At least 239 people were um, found dead. That were killed. I'm sorry. And uh, and there, there were other people that were being pulled from the rubble alive. And. Uh, Three, there were three other people they said that on Monday were managed to call for help on their cell phone and uh, dozens of people were trapped in the uh, hills of debris uh, and so, so on but there was no other reports that if there was uh, any other deaths reported um, so my prayers go out to the to the people of Turkey and these here's some um, um, photos of the uh, the Turkish uh, earthquake, uh, the 7.2 that struck on October the 29th. It collapsed buildings, and uh, there's more. I'm just gonna go through it real quick. Because I have some others that I need to talk about. The one, especially in particular, uh, what is occurring in the uh, Canary Islands, and that could affect the east coast of the United States. Yeah, you know, that looks pretty bad. But a 7.2 is it's. That can be a real shaker, you know. Uh, yeah. So Turkey is near. Well, let's see. I I would say in that proximity of the globe, um, it's quite near the Canary Islands. So, um, my thought is that since this big earthquake hit Turkey. Uh, it's quite a possibility that the uh, the activity that's happening in the Canary Island may have caused this one tur in Turkey and uh, but the problem is that the way it is situated uh, towards the east coast it's the, it's a big concern of a giant tsunami that would uh, hit the east coast of the United States. 
and uh, the reason I say this that how devastating that it can be this is a picture here uh, of a uh, and the PDF file can be uh, found at uh, Henning's uh, video so uh, but it shows here how if uh, a tsunami would occur a giant tsunami this is what how what it would look like and that where it would eat reach the uh, Pacific coast along the Pacific coast of California and the other states there and it shows the magnitude how it would spread out in this map here and um, yeah that looks pretty devastating going down along the coast here and uh, yeah, hit hitting the coast uh, but right now we're uh, concerned about the east coast right now um, but getting back to the timeline you know as we know back in January of 2010 remember that the Haiti earthquake um, which occurred in uh, Port-au-Prince was a 7.0 magnitude and then uh, just a month not shy of a month later the Chilean earthquake was a, an 8.8 and in February 22nd of 2011, the following year, um, the New Zealand uh, earthquake occurred at a 6.3 magnitude that hit in Christchurch. And as we all know, we, can rem we remember that on March 11th, 2011, a Jap Japan earthquake with a 9.0 magnitude occurred with a tsunami. Um, that struck uh, Japan, uh, northeast Japan, leaving it in, in ruins, uh, leaving um, 15,690 killed and 4,740 are missing, and 5,710 were injured. And and just recently, the Turkey earthquake uh, occurred on October the 23rd, 2011 with a powerful magnitude of 2.7 in uh, southeast Turkey leaving at least a thousand people or possibly killed um, in that region and okay this is the article I need to just speak about now the uh, Canary Islands um, near on the, the island of uh, El Hero uh, the summit is about 15,000 meters which is 4,900 feet high and actually it's it's the kind of a volcano that kind of like slopes down in, into the ocean and the concern is if a big part of this big hunk of this um, uh, this island falls into the sea it's going to cause a great really great tsunami and that's what's what's going to uh, be a big concern that will hit the east coast of the United States and uh, right into the uh, proximity of New York City so this is a, a heads up uh, I'll leave the link to this now the image here this is um, to show if I can get it um, here oh, anyway does it work here now well anyway this is uh, uh, activity of harp um, going on right now so since harp see the, these number of dots uh, harp is really beating the crap <laughs> out of this volcano okay uh, and it says that these swarms may to lead to a landslide tsunami so this is very dangerous right now um, the uh, people who live near these islands have been asked to evacuate and so this is very serious at this time uh, see if you can see here it's really heavy 
So um, my next question is, and uh, I'm running out, almost running out of time, because uh, uh, I also have uh, other data here in regards uh, to El Hero uh, about the temperature and uh, the activity that's going on, and um, here's a video uh, that shows the uh, debris falling into the ocean. Um, but, uh, did I say video? Yeah. <laughs> and um, there's uh, activity going on with the Katla volcano in Iceland. And th this is a uh, past history again on the earthquake that happened along Virginia coast. I include that. And there's also uh, breaking news about a San Francisco earthquake that had occurred also on October the 20th. So there's earthquakes going on all over the place. But like I said, the, the big concern right now is um, the Canary Islands uh, uh, possible tsunami from the Canary Islands towards the East Coast. That's what I'm trying to get at. Okay, but the question is, is that uh, the dates that are coming up, 11-9-11 and 11-11-11, now these are significant dates that happen once every 100 years. Now these dates, as you know, now I'm not into numerology, but as we know that the, uh, the Freemasons, the Illuminati, those that are, that use uh, the the numbers kind of thing. Um, it, it may be quite possible that they'll try to do something on these dates. So I just want to keep you heads up uh, on these dates. Uh, there was uh, two movies that to to come out on those dates. One was um, well, actually, it, one was titled the the the, the date itself, eleven eleven eleven. Okay, and then and that kind of strange. And uh, one thing that was mentioned in that movie, uh, it said uh, at the end of the trailer, um, and I'll include the vi um, the link to that video, also the the two trailers. And um, what they did say at the end was, uh, "They are here." Okay. So that gives you will give you something to think about. Um, I think what they're referring to is that I believe that this is the. Uh, I don't know if they're referring to a fake um, alien invasion, which we all know that they're demons. Really, I don't know if a lot of you believe that, but that's that's what they are, and. And then uh, all in the other uh, movie is called The Immortals, which is a very interesting movie. Um, it has a, like a lot of symbolism in it also. So I'll leave links to those. And I mean, I'm nearly running out of time. So uh, I'd like to mention um, Henning Kimmler's uh, video. And I'll link to his video. And he's got also a lot to explain too. Uh, about what is going on and okay I think that's uh, all I need to uh, comment on so um, I'll just end it here and tell you guys as always God bless you and Jesus loves you and if you don't know him please give your life to him today because time is short and um, and please remember guys if you live near the East Coast Please take a short a vacation uh, until it all blows over. You know, y'all take care, and uh, and I'll talk to you later. Till next time. Bye bye now.